Hey, this is Joe Bakmotsky. I'm the creator of Simplified Cancer. Look, if you're watching this, then you're dealing with testicular cancer. And look, I know that that's rough, man. And then it's hard because you want to be able to talk about it with people in your life. And that, of course, includes people you work with, you know, maybe your customers or your colleagues. And that's not easy to do because they're not your family and they're probably not your close friends. But you want to be able to have them on side. You want to have them supporting you, not just because it's going to, you know, I think make you feel so much better to have more people just being your true supporters, but also in a way they can really take some of that pressure off you, take some of that, you know, workload away from you so that you can really concentrate on your treatment and, and on your recovery. So that you're not kind of thinking about work and, and how that's going to happen and how's that going to play out without you and how you're going to return to work. So it all is about getting your people on side. And I think that it starts with being explicit about what's going on in your life and being vulnerable about it. And look, I know that it's not easy. It's not easy to open up and talk about these things that are pretty personal right? Cancer treatment and your worries. But I think it's important to share those things because people can relate to you that way. If you are open, if you are transparent, if you are direct, if you can share something about your experience right now or things that are coming up or things that are bothering you or things that maybe are keeping you up at night, that makes it easy for people to relate to. You can talk, talk about it one-on-one -on -one with someone. You can even send an email to a group of people in, in your team or in your area and just let them know that this is what you're going through and this is what you can expect to happen. And also let them know how they can support you. That really starts with your direct manager. And I would highly recommend you to catch up with your line manager or with your, with your director, someone that you're working with, someone who can really connect with what you're doing. And when you set up a meeting or easily just pull them aside for a coffee and just have a conversation and say, look, here is what I'm going through. Here is what I can expect to happen. I'm going to have this chemotherapy. It's going to last nine weeks. And then there's going to be a period of time when I'm going to recover through it. So I think for this and this task, I'm hoping that, you know, person X can help out with that. I'm hoping the person Y can help out with that. If you're okay with that, I can talk to them about picking up some of that workload. And maybe when I'm coming back after treatment, I can spend some of that time working from home, perhaps two days a week. And then we can trial that and see how that goes. Because that will help me recover and it will also help me to achieve the outcomes that I need to do at work, right? So just think it through and just focus on, I think, these three things. What's happening right now? What we can reasonably expect and what sort of help that you need and you can offer? Because I think these are the things that will show that you have thought this through. You've shared something that you can relate and you've come up with a plan. Right, which is something that most people don't do because there's a lot going on, right? But if you share something that people can relate to you, something that is personal, if you can give them a way to get on board and support you through this by having a clear plan, it's very easy for your manager, for your coworkers, for your team to really get on board and support you and be, really be your true supporters. It just is so great to... Um, honestly, have those people, you know, rooting for you in this pretty difficult time. You know, I know that at work sometimes you don't get well with every single person. But I've, I've been blown away by how much people really step up and, and those, you know, uh, conflicts or politics or, or kind of office dramas, they really fade away into the background. And people really can step up and be there for you in a big way. I think that's really important and that's something that can really support you as you are going through cancer. I hope this helps you. I, ho I hope it serves you. I just want to take a minute to tell you about all this other stuff that I've got for you on simplifytc.com. So 
on this website i've put a bunch of free fantastic resources that can really help you through your testicular cancer journey i've got a testicular cancer visual overview this is a one page graphical overview of different stages of testicular cancer and different treatments that it's really easy to print out or send to someone and really just explain them where you're at and how things are likely to play out i also got email templates like what to say to, to your workmates like we just talked about what to say to your family what to say to your friends how to kind of get them to support you in a way that is really meaningful for you so you can either just use those templates just copy and paste or you can just use it for inspirations as a starting point i also have top links to top online resources for testicular cancer which is online communities forums where you know people like me and you go people who are going through treatment of people who have already been through it and they're sharing their experience and the things that helped them through it also have a first visit oncologist checklist which is all the questions that you need to be asking your specialist you know it's really simple it just has a list of questions is a pdf you just print it out and take it with you and you know there's room to write answers and it makes sure that you don't really forget to ask something important that you don't forget because there's a lot going on and it's so easy to miss something or forget and it's great to have a reminder that can really kind of prompt you to ask the right questions and take notes so it's all there for you my friend it's all free just go to simplify tc.com put in your name and email and i'm gonna send it to you right away thank you so much for watching i'll see you soon